Hey Collectors, Anthony from Hashtag here, and today we're taking a look at Transformers, Primors, Titans Return, Misfire, and Aimless. As you see, I have the back of the box here. I did get this brand new for a pretty penny. Um, if anybody knows anything about the story here, uh, Misfire was a um, final short run for the Titans Return series. So uh, him and a few others were just really hard to find. Uh, he was the last one I needed from that particular wave. And... Um, so here we go. Uh, it came with, uh, of course, the, the box itself, which is, you know, nice and it has a cell, upsell here with the other guys. And, uh, yeah, just uh, real decent looking. And then, of course, um, there is the trading card that comes with them, which is uh, interesting. Um, they're collectible at best. Uh, it gives you the stats and stuff. Uh, and then, of course, uh, the instructions and... Um, See if I can get them to open. Yeah, just the standard times return instructions. I think this was before the don't hurt yourself paper. So just just this. And of course we have Misfire and Amos is in the cockpit. And uh, really nice looking. Now he was in robot form. I converted him to this because I wanted to be different and he's been out for a while so you probably all saw him convert it one way to this way I'm gonna go the opposite way now but uh, he's just a unique uh, like alien spaceship form I kind of dig it uh, it was not uncommon in this uh, Titans Return series for headmasters and their little Titan masters to have some type of unique form with a cockpit which I really dug kind of reminiscence kind of like back to like um, Diaclone where vehicles had cockpits and little riders so I really get the aesthetic there so let's uh, take Aimless out and uh, he is a little guy with a blue eye thing and a pink face and not quite sure how well he's gonna come out he's just so tiny and then, of course, here is Misfire's face right there. And uh, lock that back up. And uh, he doesn't look too robot-y on the bottom here. It's a nice, unique design. Uh, he does come with these two pistols. Um, let me disconnect the wings so I can pull those off. Uh, the wings tab in uh, here and here. Or, uh, they tab in? Yeah, just tab in under here. Okay. Um, pull these off. And just like many of the weapons uh, for this series, they do connect to create a like a, a ride thing, uh, you know, or dual pistols or whatever. And then you can throw the uh, Titan Master in, um, and you know that's pretty much it. Um, like thinking, is there a port? It's like no ports on the top here for him to connect to. So I guess you have to hold him and fire him as a robot. I don't know. Anyway, wings are already up, so we might as well just continue the rest of the way. So disconnect the arms, and they come out like this. And the wings are on the same arm archer, uh, except they have their own uh, joint that allows them to move back and forth. Uh, the legs unfold, uh, very similar to Windblade from Titan's Return. And uh, then you just separate them. Now there is going to be a gap in the back of the legs. Not too much you can do about it. Um, I'm a little weirded out how loose he is from being brand new, well, relatively speaking. But anyway, we fold this up and, and it cramps into here. And uh, that makes up the bottom half of him. And then, of course, we want to take his top piece and fold it back while moving the front of the ship. And uh, then we take the arms and we're going to maneuver the piece right here out of the way because it needs to oh, hold on I'm gonna double join here okay there we go pull the hand out there we go snaps into place very well again do this again maneuvering the wing out of the way slide the arm down pull out the fist if it'll let me there we go Okay, got some high shoulders right there. Oop. Yeah, so his legs are loose. Um, can't blame anybody but the uh, QC here. Um, let's see, turn his head sideways. And we'll throw it in there. 
And here we go. Here's what he looks like. It's decent. Nice face. I was going to say his uh, Titan Master's face mimic his real face. That's funny. Uh, yeah. So, uh, decent enough. I, I like the uh, front end of the knees there. And got it. It's a nice collapsed backpack. The wings are out of the way. So, yeah, you can shrug really well. So, yeah, that's pretty nifty. Uh, the gun, of course, as I mentioned, you could single fist it. Or you can uh, separate it and get it into both fists. So, uh, that's decent enough. And I kind of... Really, I like it. I'm happy to have him. Uh, I guess collection complete. There is really nothing else that I'm dying to have out of the Primor series. Um, I've slowly been picking up other parts, but uh, yeah, he's a. Uh, it's pretty good. With that said, tell me in the comments your thoughts on this item. Did you get it, and how was your experience with it? Thanks for watching, and please remember to like and subscribe.